今天我们一起阅读圣经文要把它第十篇第六十三章新一个章章节就是主Krishna跟Balasura之间作战 Shuka Ovacha Apashyatam Tanirudam Tad Bandunam Vashiko, 
Anasochatam, Anasochatam, Sri Shuka Ovacha, Sri Shuka Ovacha, Apashatam Chani Rudham, Apashatam Chani Rudham, Apashatam Chani Rudham, Apashatam Chani Rudham, Tadbandunam Chaparata, Tadbandunam Chaparata. Tad Pandunam Chaparata Tad Varshiko Varshika Masa Tad Varo Varshika Masa Yati yod anusochatam. Yati yod anusochatam. Yati yod anusochatam. Yati yod anusochatam. She shook up of a chap. She chani rudham. Apashatam chani rudham. Tat pandu nam chabarata. Chatvaro Vashika Masa Chatvaro Vashika Masa Yati Yur Anusochatam Yati Yur Anusochatam Shri Shuka Avacha Shri Shuka Avacha Apashyatam Chani Rudham Apashyatam Chani Rudham Tat Pandu Nam Chabarata Tat Pandu Nam Chabarata Chat Varo Varshika Masa Chat Varo Varshika Masa Yati Yur Anusochatam Yati Yur Anusochatam Chen Shishuka Vakha Shri Shuka Avacha Apashyatam Chani Rudham Tadvandunam Chaparata Chadvaro Varshika Masa Yati Yura Nusochatam. Very good. Shri Shuka Vacha. Shri Shuka Vacha. Sukadev Goswami said. Sukadev Goswami said. Apashyatam. Apashyatam. Who did not see. Who did not see. May come out. Cha. Cha. And. And. Uh. Anirudham. Anirudham. Anirudha. Anirudha. Tat. Tat. His. Bandunam for the relatives. Cha and Bharata, O descendant of Bharat Parikshit Maharaj. Chatvara for Varshika of the rainy season. Masa, the months, Vyati Yu, Has, Anushochatam, who were lamenting. Translation Sukadeva Goswami said, O descendant of Bharat, the relatives of Anirudh, not seeing him return, continued to lament as the four rainy months passed. Text number two. After hearing from Narada the news of Aniruddha's deeds and his capture, the Vrishnis, who worshipped Lord Krishna as their personal deity, went to Sunitapur. 
第二节译文：从拿拉达那里听闻了阿利鲁达的活动和被俘的新闻后，将主 Krishna 尊崇为他们的神的 v i s h n 人向 s o l i t a 部出发。When Lord Balaram and Lord Krishna, or with Lord Balaram and Lord Krishna in the lead, the chiefs of the Sadvata clan, Prajumna, Sadyaki, Gadda, Samba, Sharana, Nanda, Upananda, Bhadra, and others, converged with an army of twelve divisions and laid siege to Banasura's capital, completely surrounding the city on all sides. 第三四节是译文：主巴拉和主 Krishna 为首 s a t t v a t a 的族的领袖们 p r a d u n a s a t y a k i g a d a s a m b a s a r a n a n a n d a u p a n a n d a b a d r a 以及其他人，聚集了十二个师的部队，围攻了 Vamsura 的。城池从四面八方围团团围住那个城，那座城市。Text number five. Banasura became filled with anger upon seeing them destroy his cities, suburban gardens, ramparts, watchtowers, and gateways, and thus he went out to confront them with an army of equal size. 第五节是译文。巴拉苏拉看到他们摧毁了他城市的郊野花园、城墙、瞭望塔、大门，变得怒气冲天。他带着势均力敌的部队出外迎战。Text number six. Lord Rudra, accompanied by his son Kartikeya, and the Pramatas. Came riding on Nandi, his bull carrier, to fight Balaram and Krishna on Vana's behalf. Evening, Lord Rudra, with his son Kartikeya and Pramatta, Pramatta's men, accompanied by his bull carrier. 坐骑南底来了，为巴纳与巴巴拉拉玛和 Krishna 作战。Part four. Shila Shridhar Swami states that the word Bhagavan is used here to indicate that Lord Shiva is by nature all-knowing and thus well aware of Lord Krishna's greatness. Still. Although Shiva knew Lord Krishna would defeat him, he joined the battle against him to demonstrate the glories of the supreme personality of Godhead. Srila Vishwanath Chakravarti Thakur states that Lord Shiva entered the battle for two reasons: first, to increase Lord Krishna's pleasure. And enthusiasm, and second, to demonstrate that the Lord's incarnation as Krishna, although enacting human-like pastimes, is superior to other avatars such as Lord Ramachandra. Sri La Vishwanath Chakravarti further states in this regard that Yoga Maya, Lord Krishna's internal potency, bewildered Lord Shiva. Just as she had bewildered Brahma. In support of this 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 statement, the Acharya writes the phrase "Brahma Rud Adi Mohanam" from Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu. Of course, Yoga Maya's job is to make is to make fine arrangements for the Lord's pastimes, and thus Shiva. Became enthusiastic to battle the Supreme Lord Krishna. Yeah, just. Sir Sri Das Swami's name. Here, the usage of Bhagavan is to refer to Shiva's 
便全知一切，因此充分了解主 Krishna 的伟大。但尽管 Shiva 知道主 Krishna 将击败他，他仍然参战抵抗他，以证明至尊主、至尊人格手神的伟大。圣维沙那特查克拉蒂的库。称主须把参加战斗有两个原因：首先，为了增加主 Krishna 的乐趣和热情；第二，为了证明作为 Krishna 的主的化身，尽管演绎了人类般的逍遥时光，却高于其他阿尔塔，如主 Ramachandra。圣 v i s h v a n a t h a c h a k r a t i 就这一点进一步宣称 Yoga Maya 主 Krishna 的内在能量，迷惑了主须把，正如他曾经。迷惑的 Brahma 一样，为支撑这个宣言，这位 Acharya 从巴从呃这个呃风爱的半路呃巴巴提拉僧他僧主引述了短语 Brahma Vidra Di Mohana。当然 ，Yoga Maya 的工作正是为主的教时光做出精巧的安排，因此须把变得如热情，同至尊主 Krishna 作战。Om Ajnana Timarandasya Gyananjana Shalakaya Chaksurna Vitamina Tasmai Shri Gurave Namaha Vanchakalpa Tarubhyasya Kripa Sindhu Vayevacha Patita Nam Pavane Vyo Vaishna Vidyo Namo Namaha Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Gadadhar Shri Vasadhi Gaur Bhakta Binda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare So in the previous chapter, we were hearing how Usha developed a relationship with Lord Krishna's grandson Aniruddha. 嗯，我们在之前的一个章节里面，您听到，嗯 ，Usha 跟啊 Krishna 的儿子 Aniruddha 呢，他们怎么样开始一段关系交往 ？So they were staying together for some time. And then Usha's father found out. Then, 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 所以呢，阿尼布达呢，他就在巴拉苏拉的城市里面呢，就被囚禁了。So after some time, you know, Lord Krishna's family they didn't know where Aniruddha had gone. 过了一段时间之后，主 Krishna， 呃，就是他们阿尼布达他的亲人，他不知道阿尼布达去了哪里了。Because it all happened during the night. Aniruddha was taken out of the palace and put in the palace of Banasura. 嗯，所以一切都是发生在晚上。哈利路达在晚上的时候被带走了，去到了班苏拉的城市。So then the Radhamuni came and he told everything. 然后那拉德穆尼就来到，把所有的一切都告知他们。那拉尼，那拉德穆尼 makes all arrangements for the past. He helps in the all making arrangements for the past times of Lord Krishna. 所以那拉德穆尼呢，他来到呢是。So when Lord Krishna heard that Aniruddha was a prisoner and that he'd been arrested like this, then Lord Krishna came with an army. When Krishna heard that Aniruddha was a prisoner and that he'd been arrested like this, then Lord Krishna came with an army. When Krishna heard that Aniruddha was a prisoner and that he'd been arrested like this, then Lord Krishna came with an army. When Krishna heard that Aniruddha was a prisoner and that he'd been arrested like this, then Lord Krishna came with an army. When Krishna heard that Aniruddha was a prisoner and that he'd been arrested like this, then Lord Krishna came with an army. The different sons of Krishna. So Krishna, 还有跟呃还有巴拉拉米一起去了，还有其他呃他们的儿子。And some of his the very confidential associates. 有一些非常亲密的朋友。They all came, a big army, to fight Banasura. 
And they surrounded the palace of Banasura. And surrounding the palace of Banasura, they, just, they, made a, they did a lot of damage to all the gardens and the different structures which had been put up around the palace of Banasura. So they went there and put Banasura in the palace. So Banasura became very angry. Banasura is a Banasura is a is a demon. Banasura is a demon. Demons are always very proud. And they have they get very they get very angry often. So Banasura became very angry and when he saw that Krishna and Balaram were there with a big army surrounding his palace, then he called his army. So that there's going to be a great battle going to take place. And Banasura has uh, Lord Shiva on his side. Banasura Because Banasura had pleased Lord Shiva, he done great service for Lord Shiva. Lord Shiva is called Nataraj, he likes to dance. He's a great dancer. And when there's kirtan and chanting of the holy names, then Lord Shiva will dance in ecstasy. And to dance, to encourage the people to dance, you have to have nice mandanga playing. Right, when you have nice madanga playing and then you feel more inspired to dance nicely. And nice singing and the, the kirtan becomes more ecstatic. So Lord Shiva was able to do this service. Uh, Banasura was able to do this service for Lord Shiva. So Lord Shiva was very pleased with him and he offered him a benediction. So Banasura asked, he said, I want that you will always stay with me and guard my kingdom. So Banasura so Lord Shiva was residing there at Banasura's palace. And when Krishna and Balaram came, then Lord Shiva has to, is going to fight on the side of Banasura. So you see how this. Just because of the, this uh, relationship between Dusha and Aniruddha, a big battle is going to take place. But actually this battle was all the arrangement of the Lord. They want to, we, we want to show the potency, the power of Lord Krishna. So in this verse which we read, Lord Shiva is described as Bhagavan. Now usually we think of Lord Krishna as Bhagavan. In the Bhagavad Gita when Krishna speaks, we always say Sri Bhagavan Nupacha. And when Arjuna speaks, then we simply say Arjuna Uvacha. 
这个指的就是 Krishna 在说话。如果当 Arjuna 在说话的时候，就会说 Arjuna Uvacha。Just like here in the beginning of this chapter, we began Shuka Uvacha。就好像这一章节的一开始的时候就提到 Shuka Uvacha。So, uh, in this chap, in this verse, we read Lord Shiva is called Bhagavan. 在这一节诗里面，我们读到主须跋被称为是巴格巴。So Lord Shiva is called Bhagavan, and the reason is given that because he knows the position of Lord Krishna. 嗯，有一个原因，为什么主须跋这里被称为是巴格巴？因为他知道，呃，呃，至尊主的那个地位，伟大的地位，伟大。So, Lord Shiva understands that Krishna is greater than him, and that Krishna can defeat him. 嗯，主须跋他知道 Krishna 比他更伟大，而且 Krishna 能够将他击败。But Lord Shiva wants to show, take this opportunity to show the glories of Lord Krishna. 主须跋希望利用这样的一个机会去荣耀主 Krishna. So this is Lord Shiva's devotion for Lord Krishna. 这就是主须跋。Lord Shiva is therefore very dear to the Lord. 嗯，主须跋是对于至尊主来说非常的钟爱。And it said, Vaishnavam yata Shambhu, that among all the Vaishnavas, Lord Shiva or Shambhu is the greatest. 在所有的 Vaishnava 当中呢，主须跋香布他是最伟大的。So, why is Shiva so great? 为什么主须跋这么伟大？ Because he always thinks about the pleasure of the Lord. Lord Shiva is always meditating on Lord Sankarshan. Sankarshan is the expansion of Lord Balaram. So the snakes which are on the body of Lord Shiva, they represent Lord Sankarshan. 在主须跋身上的那条蛇呢，其实代表着主上和善。So Lord Shiva is taking part in this battle because he wants to encourage, he wants to give pleasure to Lord Krishna. 主 Krishna 他参与这样一场战争，其实是想啊、呃、令 Krishna 感到快乐。When Krishna wants to fight someone, he can just fight anybody. 当主 Krishna 他想要作战的时候，他不能够跟任何人去作战。Just like many of these demons, they're not, they have no ability to fight Krishna. So Krishna arranges very powerful personalities to come into this world, and then they, they fight them. So Krishna, he arranges very powerful personalities to come into this world, and then they fight them. Just like the two sons of Diti and Kashyapa, Haranyakashipu and Haranyaksha. They were very powerful demons, and they came to fight Krishna. 就好像弟弟跟卡沙拉摩尼他们的两个儿子，提拉卡西布跟提拉亚克沙，他们来到这个世上，然后跟 Krishna 作战。There, there's nobody good enough. There's nobody powerful enough to give a good fight to Krishna. 没有人更有的这个资格能力，跟让 Krishna 能够好好的去跟他打一场。So Krishna sends. Some of his per, some great personalities from the spiritual world, they come here. So, so Krishna, he from the spiritual world, to send some people to come here. But they come as demons, just to fight Krishna. But they come as demons, just to fight Krishna. But they come as demons, just to fight Krishna. But they come as demons, just to fight Krishna. So here in this case, we see it's Lord Shiva going to fight Krishna. So here we see Lord Shiva going to fight Krishna. Now Shiva is a devotee of Krishna. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he fighting Krishna? Now Shiva is Krishna's devotee. Why is he If Lord Shiva did, if there was no yoga maya, then Lord Shiva would simply worship Krishna. If there was no yoga maya, then Lord Shiva would simply worship Krishna. Because of the yoga maya, Lord Shiva can fight him and think of Krishna as the enemy. Because of the yoga maya's power, so 
主西法能够跟Krishna坐在 Brahma became attracted to his to his daughter one time. 有一次呢, 主Brahma他, 呃, and another time he 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 tried to understand the greatness of Krishna and he stole away the cows and the cow and another, another time, Lord Shiva wanted to understand Krishna's Maya. So Krishna took the form of Mohini Murti. And when Lord Shiva saw Mohini Murti, Lord Shiva became attracted to him. And he chased after her. And he went running after her. And she went to places where the great yogis and uh, where people were sitting meditating. Lord Shiva was still chasing after this beautiful woman. So it was very embarrassing for Lord Shiva. And Krishna arranged this just to show Lord, Lord Shiva the greatness of his mind. So and Lord Shiva also appreciated how powerful the Maya of Krishna is. Lord Shiva was humbled by this experience. So Krishna is a very special form, a very special form of the Lord. The Lord has many, many forms. He is something called Ananta Rupa. He has countless different forms. But the form of Krishna is the original Supreme Personality of God. It's described here that He is greater than even Lord Ramachandra. Lord Ramachandra, he has his abode as Ayodhya. Lord Ramachandra, he is a Maria, he is called Mariada Avatar, that he is very careful to follow all the etiquette. He's very strict about following all the principles of the Vedic scriptures. Right. Father gives an order, Lord Brahma will do it. And one minute the father was telling him, become the king. And then a minute later he's telling him, don't become the king, go to the forest for 12 years. And Lord Rama just said, yes, father, yes. Whatever you want me to do. So Lord Rama is very careful to follow all the etiquette. He only takes one wife, even after his wife was, leaves him, he's left without a wife. He doesn't take another wife. And he's very careful to keep all the citizens happy and to protect everyone. 
它是非常小心翼翼的保保证这个平人民啊都能够呃快乐。So pe people are attracted to Lord Rama. They think, "Oh, Lord Rama is very great." Yes, he he is great, but he is not as great as Krishna. That is true. He is very great, but he is not as great as Krishna. Krishna is very great, but he is not as great as Krishna. Lord Krishna, he doesn't care about the the Vedic rules and all the injunctions of the scripture. 主 Krishna 他不去在乎这些伟大的训示啊，呃，对。Lord Krishna is the supreme Lord. He's above all these different rules and regulations. 主 Krishna 是至尊主，所以他是超越于这些规范训示的。Lord Krishna is worshipped as the butter thief. 主 Krishna 呢被崇拜为这个偷油油、偷牛油的贼。Lord Rama would never steal anything. 但是主 Rama 他从来不会偷任何东西。But Krishna is a young child. He's stealing the butter. He's stealing the milk. 但是 Krishna 他是一个小孩的时候就去偷奶油、偷牛奶。And then Lord Krishna also is. Called Ranchor, one who leaves the battlefield. Krishna 又被称为是 Ranchor， 就是一个在战场，就是战斗的时候，逃哎这个嗯逃走的人。Lord Rama would never leave the battle. He would fight to death. 主 Rama 呢，他从来不会就是嗯退战，然后呢，他会一直一直坚持的去作战。But Lord Rama, he would go and fight. May win, may lose. That, that's not important. What's important is he does his duty. He takes part. So, so, actually, winning is not the most important. The most important is he participates in this war, fulfills his duties. But you can see Krishna, how Krishna plays with his friends. Sometimes they're fighting. Sometimes Krishna loses, and he has to carry them on his back. But we see that. Krishna 跟他的朋友如何一起玩，有时候他们就会打架，然后 Krishna 会背着他们，有时候他会输了。And their feet will touch Krishna's back. 然后他们的脚呢会碰到主 Krishna 的背。But Lord Ramachandra would never have like that. 那是主 Ramachandra 永远都不会这样。Lord Rama is the king, or he's the son of the king, so he's always on the throne and he's always worshipped and given respect. Ramachandra, he is the son of the king. He is a king, so he is very respected and honored. So Krishna is above all these rules and regulations. 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 You have to be very careful, very formal, how you behave and what you do. 嗯，就好像你去看这个国王王后的时候呢，也要非常的嗯谨慎啊，小心，然后呃，对自己的言行举止也非常的留意。And the special words you should use, how you would address such a person. 你怎么样去称呼这些人呢、啊？人物啊，你说的话。They even have a special grammar. In some countries where you address the king, they have special grammar for the, the word uh, verb endings and word endings when you speak to the king. And very special ways of respecting them. Because they are the king, they have to be given all proper respect. So Krishna is much greater than any king. He is the supreme Lord. He is above all. All, all the kings in the world, they all worship, bow, they all bow before Krishna. So all the kings in the world, they all worship, bow, they all bow before Krishna. So all the kings in the world, they all worship, bow, they all bow before Krishna. So all the kings in the world, they all worship, bow, But Krishna doesn't. Krishna himself, he doesn't want. He doesn't care about all this worship. But Krishna, he doesn't care about all this worship. He likes devotion. 
他喜欢的是奉爱，爱是sweetness，the in this particular case. Lord Shiva is going to fight with Krishna. Just like in the battle of Kurukshetra, we saw Grandfather Bhishma on the battlefield and he's fighting against Arjuna. It's all loving exchange and there's great feelings of rasa, the, lo the loving relationship, but it's expressed by fighting. The arrows which are fired into the body of Arjuna and Krishna, like these are like loving, loving like throwing Kisses at them. Or throwing flowers at them. But they're arrows with points, sharp points. So Bhishma was enjoying that rasa with Krishna. So here also we want to hear how Lord Shiva fights with Krishna. And in order to fight with Krishna, Lord Shiva has to forget that Krishna is the Supreme Lord. So even Lord Shiva, even though he's so great, so powerful, that even he can also fall into illusion and forget. But this, but this, this forgetfulness of Lord Shiva, this is the arrangement of Krishna. Krishna wants this battle to take place. And we will see one of the reasons why one is for Krishna's own pleasure, that Krishna enjoys the battle. If you just have to sit in the palace all day, it's boring, right? But if there's some battle going, oh, somebody's stolen away our grandson, we have to go and fight them. So then Krishna's become enthusiastic. Just like when we get a program, when we get an invitation to go for some program or some event or, you know, some book distribution program, we become enthusiastic. Actually, now is a, the week of, this is a, a holy week, this is a week called Dai. Um, Dasera, Navratri, there's a thing called Navratri, nine days when you worship Durga. And then on the final day, they have a big chariot procession, and they bring the Durga deity out of the temple, and they go around the temple. Uh, One man came here on Sunday and he told me, he said, I'm just beginning fasting. He said, today is the first day of Navratri. Uh, 
礼拜的第一天，我开始断食。Nine days of austerity. 嗯，一连九天的苦行。And then on the tenth day is called Dasera. 第十天就是 Dasera. That day is a big festival. 那天会有很大的节日。So many people would go to the temple on that. 很多人会那天来到庙里面。Hindu temple. 去一些印度的庙。So in in country in Bangkok, there's always a big parade and many people at the Hindu temple. 嗯，在曼谷，它有就是很多人会聚集到那个庙里面，在这个日子。So the world is becoming enthusiastic. 所以后现在变得非常的雀跃。To go out and distribute books. 然后到外面去派书。And have kirtan. 然后 kirtan. And try to make friends with people. 然后跟其其他人做朋友。So here also Krishna becomes enthusiastic. The thought of a battle. Now Krishna 想到就要作战的时候，就变得非常的热情。He was bored sitting in Dwarka. 他在 Dwarka， 他在 Dwarka 觉得非常的郁闷。Mm, becoming bored with all these beautiful wives. 跟这些美丽的妻子在一起，已经觉得非常的闷了。Sixteen thousand one hundred queens. One thousand six hundred and eight beautiful queens. One thousand six hundred and eight beautiful queens. And each one of them have a beautiful palace. 每一个人，每一位王后都有自己的美丽的皇宫。And so Krishna was getting fed up. Krishna 已经觉得够了。He wanted some variety. 他想有一些其他的呃其他的玩意。So it was arranged. Krishna could have this nice battle with Banasura. So Krishna 就安排这一场战争跟 Banasura 作战。At the same time, Krishna knows that Banasura is very proud. 但是同一时间 ，Krishna 也知道 Banasura 非常的自大。So Krishna is going to pure, going to make him humble. Krishna 就会令他变得谦卑。This Banasura has one thousand arms. Banasura 有一千只手。He is very powerful. 非常的强大。So Krishna is going to humble. Krishna 会令他变得谦卑起来。Okay, any question? 有没有问题？有问题。About the great battle. Going to take place. 对，即将描述这一场战争。And then after the great battle, then we will hear Lord Shiva offer his prayers. 在这场战争结束之后呢，我们就会听到主席法献上他的祷文。Because after the battle, Lord Shiva will come to his senses and remember Krishna's position. 当主席法作战完了之后，他就啊恢复了他的意识，知道其实 Krishna 就是至尊主。After Lord Krishna, Lord Krishna has to defeat Shiva first and make Lord Shiva. When he's defeated, then he will understand the greatness of Lord Krishna. 嗯，当主席法被击败的时候，他会，他就会意识到主 Krishna 的伟大。Lord Shiva actually knew, but because of Yoga Maya, he forgot. 其实主席法他是知道的，但是因为 Yoga Maya 的内在能量，他就忘记了。She was very great. He fought with Krishna. 有时候奉献者会想，主席法非常的伟大，因为他有能力跟 Krishna 作战。Lord Shiva said that is my ignorance. 但是主席法把这个视作他的愚昧。Okay, any questions? 有没有问题？马拉苏拉。With his army against Lord Krishna, and Banasura has got Lord Shiva on his side. And Lord Shiva has got also his son Kartikeya. Ah, so uh. And Ganesh also, two sons of Shiva. On the side of. On the side of Banasura. So, so in um um Banasura 那一边，他有主席法为他。做助战，然后还有朱熹巴的两个儿子，应该是跟这个。Kartikeya. Kartikeya. Sometimes it's called Murga. Murga. Oh, I only came out right. Oh. Is it? 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 Is
Well, Lord Shiva's position is much higher than Indra. When Indra did that, that was Indra's Mahamaya, that was not Yoga Maya. Because Indra is so attached and so proud, so arrogant and proud. Try to stop Krishna taking the Parajata tree away. So he tried to stop Krishna, but of course he could not stop Krishna. So that was Indra's ignorance. But here, in the case of Lord Shiva, this is all very, a very special pastime. We want to show the greatness of, of the supreme position of Lord Krishna. So Lord Shiva is helping to show that position of Lord Krishna. Indra, he was just proud of his position, proud of being the, the, uh, the king of heaven, head of the demigods. Indra, but Shiva here, he's, he's taken the position of being the servant of this Vanasura. Given this kind of blessing to Vanasura. So he's obliged to fight against Lord Krishna. But the Acharyas also say it's the arrangement of Krishna's pastime potency. Just for the pleasure of Krishna. Okay, Srimad Bhagavatam, please. Yeah.